I simply adore a proposal. Well, when it was proposed to Lord Ern to attend the opening night of Taylor Swift's Eras Tour, I guess the Oscar winner executed her plan to get the hard-to-come-by tickets. Well, I'll be poisoning all the other maidens in the village. Now, Lord didn't get many, many jewels to wear to the Tire Tacky Wenches concert, no. Her and her two kids be sporting cowboy hats and boas to the State Farm Stadium. Elena Heim also got the wardrobe memo. No word on how her abs look, though. I even contoured oh. my abs with the mud from the hog pen outside. Lauren Heim sang along to Being in a Public Space. I'm going out tonight. Well, not all of Heim. Well, we all know who's not coming tonight. Esty was not there. Only Danielle and Elena got be jeweled for Taylor's opening night in Arizona. Laura and her kids, Jaya and Ellery, went backstage afterwards and snapped a pic with the probably actually tired, but not tacky wench Taylor. Laura captioned the pic, celebrating our amazing buddy's first show of tour. Hmm, that's weird. <laughs> Extraordinary found family. And I think this is actual footage of Taylor thanking Laura for coming. Thank you. Thank you so much. You're welcome. I'm still haunted by that line reading of you're welcome and that facial expression afterwards. Oh. Now someone happened to catch Laura running to her seat before the show, and you probably didn't see her, but Laura wasn't the only Oscar winner we know all too well that just ran across your screen. You ready for it? There's Emma Stone right there. Yeah, Emma left La La Land to the state next door. It starts with an easy A, and she knew she belonged. She was in crazy stupid love with her life as she sang along to Taylor's 2008 hit, and she kept on being fearless. So while Laura is a new member of the Swift squad. She's the coolest. <laughs> She's so funny. She's another one. I'm like, How do you I'm like, friend. Yes. How do you, you are my friend now. Emma and Taylor's love story has been going for a while. Emma and Selena and I, we've had so much, so many things in our lives have changed over the last couple of years, but our friendship has stayed the same. 11 years after that Access Hollywood interview, Taylor and Emma are still in the lavender haze over each other. Now, Emma didn't get to hear Last Kiss like she did on the Speak Now tour, in 2011, yes. Taylor only played one song from Speak Now this time around. It just happened to be Enchanted, the song that fans have long speculated is about Emma Stone. Coincidence or totally the mastermind's style to wink at fans knowing that she and Emma we're in the same room at the same time. Hmm. Discuss. Discuss Emma. Discuss Laura. Discuss two-thirds of Heim. Discuss it all. <laughs> the opening night of Taylor Swift's Eras Tour. <laughs>